All right, guys, so here's the next projects I'm going to be working on. I have a old bourbon barrel that I'm going to turn into a liquor cabinet. So uh, the plan here is to remove all these old rings, which actually one has already, already fall, has fallen off. So remove all these rings besides these top and the bottom one, so that way it still stays, all these planks stay secure. Uh, clean those up. I'm going to sand it all the way down. Uh, I'm going to restain it poly it, uh, clean those rings up, resecure those. We'll cut a door in it and then, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. So we'll get into sanding it now. So I think I gotta kind of figure out where I want my door. So the tape is kind of the edge. And then the top will be the bottom of that ring and then the top of that ring. I think that'd be a pretty good size. <clears throat> Give you enough access to the inside. So what I'm gonna do next is to make sure that these bands are completely secure before I cut the doors. I'm gonna place some more screws along the edges here of where the door is gonna be. And uh, then we'll cut the door. So we got the door all cut off here. Uh, what we'll do next is I'll put a little bit of uh, reinforcement behind this door. So that way that solidifies the door from ever coming apart. And then, as you can see, the whole inside of these barrels get really charred from the making process. So I'll go ahead and go through and 
uh, briefly sand the inside of this and get all that off. And then we'll go ahead and mount the door. So we just finished up getting the whole inside sanded. That was quite a mess to say the least. Uh, so luckily we got that finished. What we'll do next is uh, go ahead and mount the hinges for the door. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mount them, mount two of them pretty close in the center here. And the reason being is because if you think about the shape of this barrel, it's got a, a round outside to it. So once this door is open, there'll be a pretty good sized gap at the top and at the bottom of the door. So we kind of have to put the hinges in the center here. So yeah, we'll do that next. Then I'll probably mount the latch for the handle as well. And then we'll go ahead and clear coat the inside. sitting pretty nice and I uh, just finished up getting the whole inside clear coated so that way none of that charred material comes off anymore uh, so yeah what we'll do next is go ahead and poly the whole outside and that should pretty much be about it So I just wrapped up the bourbon barrel project here. I uh, got ended up getting about three coats of poly on it, and I think it came out pretty nice. Just kind of show you the door here. I also ended up putting some lights on the inside as well. So, yep, there they go. It just came on. I just put some LED strips up top around the outside there, and uh, this is a uh, motion sensored box here, and it kicks on right when you open the door. So. So yeah, came out pretty nice. And I ended up putting the brackets in here. And uh, the customer wants a glass shelf, so um, that'll come out a little bit later. But I got the brackets all mounted in there for that shelf to lay. So yeah, guys, that's uh, pretty much going to do it for this build. Thanks, uh, thanks a lot for watching. Go ahead and comment, subscribe, and uh, there'll definitely be more projects in the future.